there's a thunder and lightning storm so if you see a flash don't worry it's just someone's molecules getting rearranged <laughs> it's Olivia welcome back to my channel today we are packing for my Disneyland trip let's get started this is just gonna be clothes that I'm packing this is not gonna be what's in my Disneyland bag I do have a video linked up here for you guys to watch if you are at all curious what's in my day bag this also doesn't include any electronics I take to make videos if you are at all interested please let me know but yeah with that now let's actually jump in the first outfit for my first day there I, I'm so excited to be going back to Disneyland. It has been like four or five years since I've been there. I haven't been since my program ended in 2017. So yeah, it's been a while. But yes, uh, so this is my homecoming outfit, if you will. The bones of the outfit are very simple. I like basics. I am bringing these shorts. These are from American Eagle. They look like the Good American ones, and I believe Old Navy also has a pair, but they're the shorts that have the, whoops, that's to the side. The rips right here on the thighs. These are just my favorite shorts that I bought this summer. They're really comfortable. I've been wearing them a lot. Love them. And then also American Eagle did this whole like high-waisted shorts, tiny top thing all summer. So black, tiny top, love it. And then with that, I'm going to be wearing a pair of white sneakers. What a shock, Olivia's got white sneakers on. <laughs> and then the ears that I'm wearing, the most important part of any Disney outfit. These are my rose gold ears. If you know, you know. And then for my layering piece, because surprisingly to no one from the West Coast, but to everyone who is, has to deal with any kind of humidity at all, when that temperature drops in California, it is nice and you like a little bit of a layer, uh, if you're me, who is always cold. And so I'm bringing my Disneyland spirit jersey. I contemplated bringing my cast member one, but I didn't want to be that guy. Also, if you know, you know, it's 2017 at the Disney parks. I might need to be stopped, but this is just, this is just the one. Next up is my outfit for DCA. The next day, we're gonna be seeing Avengers Campus, which I am so excited for. Oh my God, I've been wanting this place to open so badly. I am so much more of a Marvel fan than I am a Star Wars fan. So when this was announced, I was like head over heels so excited also guardians of the galaxy mission breakout probably one of my favorite rides if it's not part of the original pirates of the caribbean in disneyland it's definitely guardians of the galaxy mission breakout and it's better than tower of terror i said what i said i'm gonna be wearing the same shorts as the previous day i do have like two other pairs of shorts that i'm bringing with me the just in case i decide i don't want to wear the same pair again these have a little drawstring they're really cute and comfortable. They're very soft. American Eagle, everything I own is from American Eagle in case you're curious. This is also another pair of like dark shorts, but they've got the cuffs that would also work with this outfit as well, but they're not as distressed. Anyway, so back to the full fit. I got this off of the Shop Disney website. They were doing a like two, no, it wasn't a deal. It was, the t-shirts would be like 24 or something each if you bought two or more. So I bought myself a little Spider-Man t-shirt. I'm not actually the biggest fan of Spider-Man, but the the land is mostly themed to Spider-Man, so it was like, oh, I'll just get a Spider-Man shirt, and who doesn't like Tom Holland? So yeah, my little Spider-Man t-shirt. I'm gonna tie this up real cute and wear it with my shorts. And then with that, I am the queen, like once again, the ears, the most important part. I got bright red ears. I've seen Captain America ears. I don't want them. I don't like them. Usually I'll rep my man cap, but I just wasn't into any of the, like any of it. So I was like, I'll go Spider-Man. So red ears it is with that fit. I'm also just once again, gonna be wearing white sneakers because I don't want to pack too many pairs of sneakers. I have a pair of Reebok uh, Club C's classics that I wear, and then I also have my white platform Converse as well. Those are my two pairs that I'm bringing with me. And then, and then, and then, so it has been spotted. Oogie Boogie is up above DCA. Also on one of the freeways in California, there has been a giant Mickey pumpkin sighting. Ergo, Olivia's gonna wear a Halloween outfit. Now these are my new Halloween ears. These are the Haunted Mansion ones designed by Her Universe. You can find them at Memento Mori in the parks. They're not online. Um, well, Memento Mori is the one in Walt Disney World you can find, but you can also find them in the Haunted Mansion shop outside the one in Disneyland, I'm sure. But that's not, if you've been to Disneyland, you're probably not watching this one. For my Halloween inspired outfit, I am going to just wear a basic um, black dress. This is from Forever 21, it's a little skater dress. It's just comfortable and flattering. I love it. And then with that, this is one of my favorite sports bras actually, and they don't make it anymore. And I'm so sad. This is a Gymshark sports bra. I really like this detail right here. It's got a little extra strappy bit. Adds a little more uh, pizzazz and interest 
to the dress when I wear it. So there's my little spooky outfit. If not, honestly, this is just a good everyday outfit and I can pick another pair of ears to wear if it turns out. This is why it's day three. So I can actually like suss out if there's Halloween decorations up or not. But if it is spooky, I will be in fact, I haven't gotten to wear these ears yet and I'm so excited to wear them. These are my orange ones. As many of you probably know, orange and yellow are my favorite. Yeller? I've been in the South too long. Orange and yellow are my favorite colors. So I wanna wear my orange spooky, uh, they're kind of like corduroy uh, material. I wanna wear these with that dress and have it be cute and spooky. And you know what, if not, I'm the Halloween decoration. I do wear orange a lot, so I'll put that together. We are gonna spend a day in LA, so let me show you my LA outfit. Okay, so I'm thinking for LA, we are gonna go, I know Sarah said she wanted to go to the church where the music video for My Chemical Romance is Helena is filmed, so we're probably gonna make it over there, but I am much more of a uh, hippie in my style in recent years, although I was a former emo kid. Never forget those scene days, never ever. But the outfit that I want to wear to LA potentially is a pair of shorts with my Jim Morrison, The Doors t-shirt. This is from Target. But if I decide mm, I wanna step out a little bit more, I will be wearing this cream colored, it looks white, tiny top that is also from American Eagle. And then I love this skirt so much. I wore it to my sister's graduation, but it can also be super cash. This orange, uh, midi skirt. Is it midi? Yeah, it's about midi. I'm just short. Midi skirt that I got from Madewell. Cute, comfortable, a little bit nicer. That's only if I truly feel it, feel like stepping out. But yeah, that's my LA outfit. And now let me show you like all the little like travel and sleep stuff I'll be bringing. One travel outfit that I have is gonna be, I don't like to wear shorts for any reason actually, unless I am physically outside. So for the plane, because I always get cold on the plane, I'm gonna have on a pair of black Athleta leggings. These are my, the Salutation Stash Pocket, Stash Pocket 7 8th length, I believe. And then I also have from Athleta, because it's my favorite workout brand ever. Uh, this is just a like gray tie-dye t-shirt. A different travel outfit I have is the same pair of leggings, just in this olive color that I, I love this color. I keep buying it. It looks pretty cool, brings out the color of my eyes, just saying. So I'm gonna have those and then a plain black t-shirt with that. And then I'm also bringing a pair of mom jeans just in case. I probably could bring my Mickey ones, but if I decide I wanna wear mom jeans, you know, not on Disney property, these are the safer bet. And then of course, pajamas, black sweatpants from Victoria's Secret, and then just a big New England Patriots t-shirt. And then I can't decide which hoodie I wanna bring just because I always bring a hoodie, even though I've got my spirit jersey, just again, just in case. I have this black cropped hoodie. This is from Target. I wear it all the time. I don't think I'll need it because it is gonna be in the 90s while I'm there, but with me, you never know. But I also have, I have like no Disneyland t-shirts. I will be buying quite a few while I'm there. The other one, I have this Disneyland hoodie. This is like the regular. It came in a full size hoodie, but then like I bought a size too small. So it shrunk in the, like it's shrunk in the wash. So then I cropped it, took the hood up, or it took the little pocket off and made a little Disneyland crop hoodie. But yeah, everything else, like I said, I'm bringing two pairs of sneakers. Tons of masks because there is a mask mandate in LA County, Orange County, and then Disneyland also requires that you have a mask on in all indoor venue, indoor places, and on indoor rides and line queues. So yes, and then obviously toiletries and the like. But again, you can see all of that in my other videos. That is it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, please feel free to leave them in the comments down below. I will gladly answer them. Click that subscribe button. There is zero height requirement to hang out here. And yeah, don't forget to click the like button and all those wonderful things. All social media links are linked in the description below and I will see you guys next week. Bye. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? It's Olivia. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are packing for my Disneyland trip. Yes, in sunny California.